Also, hey everyone. Sorry, I'm just kind of waking up still. My stream is showing up twice on YouTube. I mean, I have two YouTube channels. Does that count? Is that what you mean, or do you mean something else? Because if you're subbed to both of the YouTube channels, then it doesn't really matter, I guess. Also, I gotta get my skip, uh, skip counter up. And I guess while we're here, we could do a prediction, because you love those predictions, the Gamba. Uh, what will happen first? Odd skips, even skips. I keep track of skips, if you're wondering, for people who are new here. And triple stacked Bowser. If we see triple stacked Bowser at any point during this stream before the last clear and showing the skips on stream like this, for example, if you see this on, on stream with the green number changed to like an odd or even number, then, you know, odd or even wins before triple stack Bowser. But triple stack Bowser has a priority. If we see at any point when the prediction timer is up, then it counts. So. Did I ever get scared of my life count? No. I, dude, at, at one time, yes, but no. I haven't for over 10,000 clears. I have never cared, to be honest. Same channel for dual stream? All right, let me take a look. Let me see what you're talking about. What, 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 which one? Is it my VOD channel? Or is it my main channel? Does it say the stream archives? Or does it say Roy on it? I want to know. Let's see. Let me check live. I only see one on my VOD channel. Let me check my main channel. I wait. Am I reading this right? Hold on. I'm on the wrong account. Hold on. Switching can be tough sometimes. Uh, where is my YouTube? Can I get to my YouTube channel, please? What? See my channel. There we go. I know. Grasp your new power. I only see one. I'm, I'm checking my channel right now. I only see one on each one. I have two YouTube, two YouTube channels up. And live, both the VOD channel and the main channel. So I, I don't know what you're seeing, but I look, I checked. There's only one live per. So also, Jabber not thank you for the team and gets up the step. I appreciate that. Oh, I know, I know this level. I think I have to use the the what you call it. Yeah, and they're gonna block me off here. I bet you. I think there's like things to block me off. So what I need to do? Oh God. I'm pretty sure this level has spikes in it. I'm just gonna skip it. I'm pretty sure there's spikes at the bottom somewhere. You get the both VOD and main channel on my homepage when you're live? Yeah, that's fine. Pick one, you know? They're the same stream. Oh gosh. Oh right, they're shelmets. <laughs> I was wondering why this is super expert until I realized, oh yeah, that's not a buzzy. Oops, I, I, dude, I just woke up. Oh, man. I mean, I just started a stream, Mr. M. You're fine. I don't think I should be playing this, but... Oh, I need speed here. Uh, I no longer have the speed required for this jump. I was on top. That's so unfair. How am I supposed to know that? I'm supposed to go on top and do it. Whatever. Looks like a job for you. There we go. Net neutral. Uh, Tui Tui. Are you talking about the world ends with you? The one on the Switch? 
I kind of lost interest in it, like, throughout half of the game. It's not bad, it's just... I miss the old combat. It was, It's good, it's just... I miss, like, the DS structure of it, you know? Where you're, like, using the D-pad and the stylus at the same time. I miss it a lot. I find the first game a lot more fun because of it. It also, like, builds... I don't know how to explain it, but like a multi-thinking, like it's basically multitasking it in a nutshell. Yeah, I'm, I'm good on this one. Fox and the school asked me, tell us the story of Roy Roo and Desencia teaming up to take out the evil Fox and the Skull. Army matey, gather round and I'll tell you a tale of Roy Roo, Desencia, and their quest to vanquish the notorious Fox and the Skull. It all started on a stormy night. When Roy Roo, skilled in the ways of Super Mario, sailed across treacherous seas to reach Desencia's island, they joined forces, both armed with their gaming skills and determination. Roy Roo, known for their lightning-fast reflexes, and Desencia, with their strategic approach, made quite the formidable team. Together, they set sail on their galleon, navigating through deadly levels, Dodging fire spewing piranha plants and overcoming. What? That, that's it? That, 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 that's that. We're just gonna stop there. All right. Fair enough. Uh, Foxing for the bits. And no, I'm never. YouTube chatters are weird. All right. Let me just point this out. Who's also waiting for the feet reveal? Guess I'm the only one. <laughs> yeah, I wonder why. <laughs> Oh, this was like a fun level, actually. Uh, sorry, Casper, though. I gotta... I'm at 40 lives. Yeah, I know. Exactly, right? Foxy just kind of stops her like a... You know, it's like next uh, episode, basically. We didn't even get a finish. I don't know why my dog is... Hey, I don't know. It's always like trying to move my uh, wire controller cord and it's just like pulling it away from me, you know? Okay, but like, oh, I see the issue. Oh. I mean, this doesn't seem like a bad level, but it's easily cheesed right now. Did they know that how easily this is cheesed? I wonder. Also, did they know I could just do this? Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, I needed that to make one-ups! Shit! Okay, wait, 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 I can reset, right? Hold on. Yes, I'm also gonna grab this. Wait, I could just do this. Uh, actually, it's kind of risky. Hold on. Yes, throw me the stars. Yes. I don't know why I just did that, but it's fine as long as we just don't take damage. There we go. Uh, don't kill Yoshi. There we go. Now we're good. I almost, like, jumped on the swamp with the star, and I was very afraid. Okay, now we can do our own thing. Why did they give me a fire Yoshi? 
I don't understand why they didn't give out a Red Yoshi. Like, they must have cheated themselves. There's no way, right? They just knew. And they wanted to make them, you know, make the level easier on them, right? That's just how I see it. I'm gonna do the out of spite for the creator. I didn't have to do anything for the one of spite, by the way. Is it actually Ryson? I wouldn't know. And also, hey Raph, I see that you were bored, yes. Also, welcome in uh, Bongzilla. Nice name, by the way. Mario's hardest winter? Yeah, when you have to do shell jumps in the freezing cold, I can understand. Hmm. Alright. I'm gonna die! Oh, okay. Wait! I thought it was going the other way! Ugh. Actually, hmm. I don't know how tight this level actually is, so I can't boot for that. But I thought about it, I'm like, hmm, is this really fair? With all the fireballs around? If it had no fireballs, I would say it's a very fair level. Because you have a chance to think about it. Until you look at the timer and they're like, hmm. How fast do you really have to go? But since I didn't actually see the end of the level, hard to say. Suddenly, very cramped boss rush level. With the clue condition, it probably has. And you probably guessed it. Shouldn't say anything. I should just be using this strap. Like, this level doesn't really deserve it. Uh, an actual real chance. Because there's no power up, so what do you want me to do about it? So I am going to pause buffer until I see an actual fairness to the level. Do I have to fight her? I mean, I can go back and get that power up. Uh, we're going to get the power up. We're just going to get the power up. I'm dead. Not dead. I thought maybe it'd be on the door. I'm going to hit her once. Go over here. Gonna hit all of them. And I'm gonna have them come over here, if possible. Yes, yes, yes. All right. I don't know why he wasn't following me, but I know how to do this next time, so it's fine. You hit all three of them, and then you come towards the snake block. Do a big jump, and it should be fine. Actually, hit one of them with the fireball. Have the whole stack fall. No, it's too tall. You're gonna stop right here, aren't you? I saw that other snake block. I'm just gonna go on the next one. I wanna see if this level's worth it. If I can get top, it probably is worth it. You know, this level had some concrete actual difficulty, and then they just threw this, so. Up. Hmm. All right, I'll give it one more try. So I need to hit all three of them at the same time, damage boost on purpose, and get them all in the same spot, and then I want them to go onto the snake block with me and then die. That's the idea. Makes me believe there's a hidden star somewhere still, though. I don't know why, I just... I feel like, how are you supposed to do that with only a fire flower? It makes no sense, right? Hmm. 
Jump over Windy. Fire Flower, triple stack. It's fine. Now I win. If I don't lose to this thing. I could have jumped there, but I don't want to risk it. What if I don't, you know, what Let's if I don't get on up. the next go, so? It wouldn't be worth it. Also, they could just have made the goal, like, super close. I don't know why they didn't. Space. What is it? The it would have been faster than this. We don't know. Or at least we didn't know until now. Hello, I'm Douglas Rainholm, and I'm not a scientist. But I do have a better understanding of what space is than any scientist living today. Where did I gain these insights? From this man, the founder of Spaceology, Beth Gaga Shaggy. No relation to Lady Gaga or Shaggy is the founder of Spaceology. A religion, not a cult. In other words, when it comes to space, he's the man with his head screwed on tight. Alright, thank you for the bits. I'm doing it not because of the, like the boss rush stuff, which is kind of bleh. It's because of the snake block section. It's like a, literally almost a minute of the whole level. It's just it's, it's boring snake blocks. Like just bring the level closer, end the level. Problem solved. That's more like and then uh, does Jack Sparrow. I hate look. You know, it's all AI. Who cares? It's also have a good time, right? Uh, Concha, thank you for the tier 3 for 32 months. This is a certified content wheel moment for tier 3s. We'll add it to the queue here. Oh, hey, then we got two of them now. This gives me more of a reason to actually, you know, do it. Let me add the command here. We have times two. Which means if we if a run dies early, we do another one right afterwards. Or we do up to two hours worth. One hour for each redemption at max. I will do those eventually. I want to, like, queue them up a bit more. And then when I don't have anything going, like, tonight I have Phasmophobia. And I don't think I got anything to do on, like, tomorrow. So maybe we'll just get all that done tomorrow, perhaps. Maybe that's when we'll do it, yeah. Difficult level. I heard Bonsai Bills. Is this a triple jump? It's starting to look like a triple. Okay, hold on. Don't die. I don't know what that was. Is that your thumbnail? Is that what that is? No idea. I don't know if that's actually what you're supposed to do, but I was so afraid I was going to die there. There better not be a staircase later. Huh. You know, I could probably bring a shell with me here. If I do that, not only does this issue go away, but I can make one-ups too. Oh, 
We'll get this guy. Look at that bouncing, though. <laughs> Physics in this game are kind of funny. Fine, we'll do it the really boring way then. Here we go. I'm never gonna have a low timer because of this, but you never know if you can trust the level with one ups. One more and then I can hit him twice. There. And now we go through this. The one up over there. But they clearly know about one-ups in their room. I only would have gotten one. So they clearly knew about one-ups in their level, they just chose not to give us any. I gotta do it. I mean, this is my blood. I have to. I don't want to do it anymore. In fact, I don't know if I want to do any of this at all. Because the ding dong makes me think... If this is just a death pipe, though, it's not... That other one has to be a death pipe, right? There's no way it's real. Ride the seesaw. Yep. I should just take in the reset doors. They thought letting me see it was reward enough. Thanks. I knew I could count on you, Ryston. I'm dead. There's no way, right? Yeah, there's no way. I have to wait. Isn't this the level from the person in level sharing it about a half a month ago or a month ago? Hold on. I give me a second here. Let me check my Discord. I recognized it for a second there. Is isn't this the same person? Hold up. Level sharing. Yes, it is. It's actually them. Look at this. Unless they changed their... Unless they re-uploaded it for some reason. This should be the same code. It is! It is this. Okay, so if I remember correctly, that pipe actually kills you. Let me double check. That's why I didn't want to touch it in the first place. Hold on. Wait a moment. Let me. 
use the level viewer and let me double check where this pipe goes because that's really important before we do anything else though, i need that level kit the fact i got this in endless though is kind of funny oh no it doesn't kill you all right i'm still suspicious i always am but here we are so this is a person who really ugh. I don't even know what, like, I, look, let me show you their other level after this to explain the, the story behind it. It's hard to explain otherwise. Here, let me show you their other level. I told them they want me to play it, they gotta spend channel points. This one. This is the one that they shared and level sharing a long time ago. I don't really remember a lot of it, but here we are. I think there are trolls in this level, but I'm not entirely sure. I mean, there has to be, otherwise I would not have booed it. But also because darkness, and I hate darkness levels that just don't provide enough light. If I go fast enough... It's just completely like you don't know where every look, you don't know what any of this crap is at. Nor is it very fair. Mostly because Nintendo! You see the issue here. Anyways, that's their other level. But we're not gonna give them the time of day when it comes to the newest level. If they want me to play it, they send in channel points. Make me play it. Hello, Anderson. Welcome in. A small world. I wish Seamus was here or Mice. They would love to see that happening. Short Kaiser level. Sure, why not? Oh. That was nice of you. Is this fast? No. Do I Z jump here? It doesn't tell me to Z. I'm not gonna Z. You didn't tell me to do it. That's kind of cool. Sadly, Yoshi is not. I'm assuming just regular jump. I don't like the low spikes like that, because it can easily kill you for free. Other than the low spikes, this level's solid. That's an interesting GG emote. Oh, that's the curved one. Ah, yes, little curves. Cause he likes his like, you know, Kirby. I, I kind of want to play this just for fun. And then I went right into the Brana's face, but I kind of want to play it again. I need to focus here though. Okay, I changed my mind, goodbye. That is awkward. And I did not expect that because it wasn't really shown. But you're supposed to like land on that uh, shell or Koopa that's bouncing, grab the shell, and then do a shell jump. That would be too hard for Endless to do feasibly. Unless you're like Raph, I guess, because he has a lot of experience in it. But like if you don't have, like if you have like Jack of all trades in terms of like how you're supposed to do things, then no, it would not be good for Endless because you're not trying to focus on one thing. They knew about the cheese. Yeah, they knew about it. I think we can do something like this. Am I supposed to get up there? I think I'm supposed to get up there. Because I saw a door up there. Wait. 
I'm actually supposed to make those jumps. I thought that was just like cheese, but it was not. Yeah, the door is checkpoint. You have to go up there. You can't do it up here, it's impossible. That is so rude. It could have been anything else, I probably would have died. I think there's enough things on screen, but... I need all of them to shoot again. Yeah, I need all of them to shoot. There we go, three one-ups. Triple jump, 10 seconds, time attack. Don't even know what I need to be doing with that shell above me. I think I'm just gonna skip it. If it's already too hard for endless at my current skill level, then no reason I'm playing it because you just lose lives constantly. Is this a minute? No, it's an up throw. This might be worth it. When I mean by minute, I was looking for like the one way minute. Oh. oh gosh. That is so unfair. How am I supposed to know? Ah, once it spawns, it spawns, I guess that's that. Hmm. I don't know if I'm gonna get that Z jump thing again. I'm gonna skip it. There's a good chance I don't get it. Hey, Land V. Puzzle level? Maybe? There we go. Am I supposed to toss this? I don't know what it wants, actually. I guess I'm supposed to have the shell at this point? Or not shell, the pal? Did I mess up with the pal? Oh, the pal's coming up here later. I might need that enemy above, so I should not be hitting it with this shell. Right? Oh god. Right? Is that correct? Yes. Let's keep this up! 31 on the 31st? What are the odds? That is pretty lucky, I would say. I don't know the odds. What am I supposed to be doing? Like, can I go up there? I can put a spring over there. I need this pow, don't I? So I have to use the spring over here. Wait, there's another spring right here. What the heck? Wait, what? It just spawned. Oh, 
What about the other spring, then? What's the point of it? Hmm. We go over here and get this red coin. Are the red coins required or optional? That is a good question. Uh, raise them from thank you for the 31 months. Welcome back. And yeah, it is. That is actually pretty lucky. Dang. Here's another way to make one right here. Uh, we make this jump. That jump looks like terrible. Jesus. I'm gonna hold on to this. I don't trust it. I need a shellman on my head, but I still need the spring from earlier. Actually, no, I don't. There's a way around this. Please let me go. Mm, stupid seesaws. Why even have him? Uh, high deck. Could've just gone the other way, honestly. It would've been much better. I know it's labeled as a one-shot, but I still think it should have a checkpoint rather than a clear condition if it's gonna be a very long level. Three minutes puzzle solving. Yeah, that sounds about right. And since it's a one-shot, you bet your darn ass it's gonna be required for the red coins, 100%. Um, I'm, uh, uh, how do you expect me to grab that? <laughs> That's the neat part, you don't. Uh, do I just lose now? Because of whatever that was? Yeah, probably. I mean, I might as well see how far this level really goes, right? For fun. I wish I can grab you right now. Nice. I'm trying to think if there's a way to come back and grab, but I don't think there is. Wait, is there? Wait, really? It's gonna let me have it? Oh, all right. I'll take a freebie. Uh, rather, a reset, I guess. I forget there was ground down here. This should be right. Yeah. Hey, Fox. See you're still hanging around. You're very quiet, though. Probably playing a game. How do I want to do this? I guess like this. Then go down and then do the thing. What the heck is this? This one shot though. Gotta go to a sub at some point. He's epic. Welcome in. Nice place for a checkpoint, am I right? I am so mad right now. I went back for that pal for no reason. I'm so tempted to just boo it for that. What is the point? You know what? Eat that. First time catching a stream. Well, hopefully, it won't be the last. I'll be doing this like every day, Monday through Friday. 
As long as I'm not busy or anything like that. I what? Uh, why? Was that me? Was that meant for me or for Lemmy? Actually. Oh, that was meant for the shell that never spawned properly. What? That's weird. Um, what's the point that on offs that don't work? You know? Oh, I see. Let's see how it works. This is suddenly super hard for no reason. It's a neat level. The clear condition made it kind of annoying. Oh, yeah, of course he's not required. See that the on-off is working now, just in a different placement. Just how many? What is that hitbox? I bet you Roy has it. Just a hunch. Well, what do you know? Ah, oh, God, he stepped on me. <laughs> Jesus. Am I dead for that? No, but I would like this and a mushroom, please. No way I just dodged all of that. Hold on, I have to do this. Damn, I was really hoping I could duck and get under it and then grab it, but... It's not Super Mario World, so you can't even do any of that! I gotta hold right or left. Alright, still gonna... Oh, hello, pal! That does not matter in the level. Congratulations, I could be used to you earlier. Um, okay, it looks like you get time to actually do this. Yeah, I'm doing this. This is dumb. But the POW clear condition doesn't make any sense! <laughs> it really doesn't make any sense. Just put a checkpoint in your level. Or rather, just remove the clear condition so I don't feel like I need to hold on to a, a dumb POW the whole time. Please. I mean, I guess without the clear condition, you'd be like, oh, I don't need this POW, so the ending would be dumb, but then you, you would just have a POW anyway, so you can just go in the goal. I don't know. It's weird. It really just needs to either have no POW clear condition or just be structured better, better so you hold the POW the whole way, you know? I have a feeling there's a hidden block under that spike, but I'm just gonna do this now and get it out of the way. Ah, uh, yes, the classic. I wonder if I need that moon later on. It's a step forward. I don't want to find out there's hidden blocks there. I would like that mushroom though, if you don't mind. I know the power situation. Oh. What if I do this? Yeah? I got hit by it anyways. Well, time to get the pal, I guess. That mushroom was pointless. Maybe. I might actually need it later. I feel like the pal is now cheese. Uh-huh, what's over here? Anything? No way to get past that without a hidden bomb, so it has to be through the sub world. But. Oh! 
Why are you there, hmm? What is this? Why are you here? Why would you give me a random fire flower like that? Did you just go over the top of your stage somehow? I think you did. Great. Well, I might as well mark it while I'm here, right? Why not put a dev bomb instead? I know, right? Like, what is the point of this fire flower? Actually, I'm gonna... Hmm. I don't know what it wants me to do now that I think about it. I suppose... Oh, okay. I see the fire flower requirement, but... We kept it. And then the duck, so that's good. Oh. What? Am I witnessing right now for level design? <laughs> I couldn't do my level, so here's all the hidden fire flowers. Jesus. I don't even need to mark that one, I don't think. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I'm marking this one. <laughs> I see why it's in Super Expert. That's pretty funny. I'm just going. Like, at this point, does it matter? That's fine. As long as I find the right one. Is it? Yeah. If it didn't have a hidden crab, I probably wouldn't, but I don't know. It didn't seem that bad. The level itself is doable without the hidden crab. Uh, who tell people they were the prime welcome to the hideout? Almost sounds like a Genshin player, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong, though. Who knows? I stopped playing before Hu Tao came out, though. I just see it all the time. People are crazy for that character for some reason. Even though apparently she's really boring to play when you maximize her. What am I doing here? I see, but you know, I need the one-up, so... I'm gonna raise you... Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. I'm gonna raise you a one-up here. Please work. Good. And then my dog is stuck on my cord again. What are you doing? Get off of it! God. My head dog. He's over here wagging his little stub at me like it's all fine and dandy, but... If you get stuck on my cord, I can't play the game when I pull back sometimes. Why did I do that? Oh, it's fine. What? It's like a racetrack or something. Oh, hello, sir. Yeah, I need you. Come here. Yes, now you're in my new defense. Let's go. Watch this maybe one-ups anyways. Or there might be a bumper ant. Never mind, it's, it's nothing. This is such a weird level. Yes, I posted a picture of my dog. It should just be in the Discord, honestly. You were once again an enjoyer that I stopped playing. I stopped playing such a long time ago. I had um, D. Luke when D. Luke was strong, you know. And then I stopped like first few months of the game. It wasn't, it's not really necessarily a bad game, it's just, it's a, it's a gotcha, so it's like, it, it's already determinedly going to be bad anyways. Just because it's predatory and they don't care about you at one bit or about the game at all.
Okay, so we don't want to do anything with that. I have to know for science. What is stopping me from doing? Answer acquired. <laughs> but then they had, did they have to soft lock me for that? Fair enough. I couldn't see the thwomp, so I didn't know what the contraption was. Can I go in that pipe? Wait. That would have been a really sick dev exit. It's been way too much for the polls. I think it's been like $300 and that's it. And then I realized I don't like gotchas that much. And then, but then I played Terra Fantasy. And I was also not very happy with their game design. I was just getting tired of it. And then I played Honkai Star Rail, but this time I was fully free to play. And I quit without even thinking about it. It's not because it's not a, like, okay, Star Rail's the best out of all of them. But when it comes down to it, they're not going to focus on getting as much content out as possible, right? They don't care about getting that much story or gameplay related stuff. They're still going to steal your money, basically. And when I, at that point, I realized I don't want to play gotchas anymore unless, well, Sugar told me that the Final Fantasy gotcha is really good, apparently. As a free-to-play, spe especially. And I'm like, okay, but my, my phone can't handle it. I have an old phone, so... And I don't spend that much on it anyways. It's just in case, like, the streams go down, I can get on it real quick and let you guys know. Although I haven't logged into my Twitch in a long time on that, so... Yeah. I'm just gonna start doing this for safety reasons. Yeah. Good. All right, now what do we do here? Folks at the school asked me, tell us the story of Royru leading me to die to a ghost. Ah, oh, matey, gather round and let me spin you a tale of treacherous delight. Picture this. The winds were howling, the moon was high, and Royru, that scurvy dog, had led us into the heart of a haunted mansion. We were searching for a legendary treasure, you see? But as fate would have it, a pack of vengeful spirits emerged from the shadows. Panic spread like wildfire. Roy Roo, fear in their eyes, abandoned ship and left ye to fend for yourself against those ghastly ghosts. But fear not, for ye held your ground like a true pirate, outsmarting those ethereal fiends. Yeah, but they got one thing wrong. I'm not a person who just like ditch people for that kind of stuff, especially in such a dangerous aspect. Uh, yeah, thank you, Hutao. I enjoy my YouTube videos when editing them sometimes. Like, lately I've just been needing a little bit of a break, so... We should be back on track soon. I wanted to make one today, but I woke up super late. And I'm like, well, I'm just gonna stream instead today. I don't know, actually. Uh, honestly, it's good enough for ja Oh, hold on. We're in an auto-scroller now. I gotta pay attention. Do I want him to go on top? Yes, apparently. How am I what? How am I supposed to know that? I have seen those many contraptions and thought they were gonna troll me literally every single time. So, like, how am I supposed to know? It's an anti-jump mechanism, usually. Too many ideas, I think, is the problem with this level. I apparently missed timing for that, but I don't think I need my hammer that badly. I could be wrong, though. If I need the hammer, this is kind of lame. If this kills me, you know what? I'm not even gonna bother. Yeah, I'm good. 
Wait, am I not supposed to have this or is this optional? Oh, it's optional. But I don't need any of it, so I'm gonna leave. I wish I would have grabbed that key and kept it now. Am I on a time limit? I think so. Honestly, Fox, you probably deserved it, let's be honest here. If I left you in the dark for some reason, because you deserved it. Dude, that's not enough time, what do you mean? It's like, dude, this is like a P-Switch timer, and how bad that is. She's the bonus storm. That's okay. Can you still use that program to see the level layout? Yes. Actually, you know what? Let me add that as a command for YouTubers as well. Hold on. Uh, let's see. What's this one right here? I'll add that as a command for everyone. The other one. So add command. It'll be exclamation point viewer and then this. There. Now every YouTube viewer can use exclamation point viewer. You know what, I should also ask, uh, add the Discord one too, I guess, at some point. Let's see. Let's just do this. We'll add the Discord command as well. There. Now both of those commands are usable for YouTube viewers. Puzzle dungeon, huh? I don't know what kind of cooldown it's on. I'll have to check it after stream, but it should be worth it. check something. Mm. I just wanted to make sure if it, if it was working or not. Coins! You lured me. Oh no, not more coins. Rip. Might be cheese or something, but we'll... Actually, might be bad. Now that I think about it, I should probably not have killed a single one. Can I like reset just to be safe? I don't want to hit that yet. Do I need a bomb? What do you want me to do here? Folks at the school asked me, tell us the story of YouTube viewers that sailed over to Twitch and had more fun. me hearties for i have a tale to tell there once were these landlubbers 
YouTube viewers they were, seeking a grand adventure. The winds of fate blew them towards Twitch, mm. where streams be mighty and chat be rowdy. They hoisted their sails and sailed forth, leaving behind the safe shores of YouTube. On Twitch, they found a treasure trove of content, Oh, I did do it right. With streamers wild and lively. They laughed, <sighs> they cheered, they spammed Kappa in chat as their spirits soared high like seagulls in the sky. They discovered a whole new world of emotes and subtracts where loyalty matters. Am I just screwed now because level design? Okay, good. Thank you. Might even get a like for that. Uh, Fox, thank you for the... Hey, you, you're fine. Thank you for the bits. Uh, you really like your story time, don't you? Alright, we're gonna go down here first. How do I... Bob is not gonna work there. He doesn't have enough time. Wait. It don't matter, right? Because I could just run over it. Right? I can literally just run over this and then go in it. Yeah, what was the point of that if it doesn't have any use? I don't see actually. What is this? Apparently, you can get a P switch down here at some point. If I kick it, what happens? What? You can't hit it from here? This is news to me. Well, I guess I better hit it. This doesn't even stop me. Oh, what am I doing? I'm just messing around at this point. There we go. Now we go down and... That's with this stuff down here. Yeah. Looks like I have to go the other way around to get this one. How long is this level? Only 300 seconds for a... Oh, oh boy. Like it's... Okay, I might leave it as a neutral in that aspect of this is way too long for a no jump level without 500 seconds already predetermined. And then random boss. Fair enough. It is a Zelda dungeon. It has to have a boss, right? There's so much on the screen! What am I doing? Oh, 
Okay, let me pause for a second. Now what do I do? I think I can cheese this, but hmm, I think I better play along. How do I get the other pal? Actually, that's a good question. How do I get the other pal? Huh, maybe it doesn't matter. Cause now I can throw bombs at him, right? In theory. Seconds. I don't got time for this level creator. I'm holding right. I'm holding right, please! Why is there a bonus section? Oh, please. Oh my god. It was a crappy bonus section, too, that had like no big coins. Please, dude. Uh, I don't know. I think it is. Wow, it was 500 seconds. Can't even boo it for that then, it's just awful. I'm gonna just write too long. I think that's the most punishment I can give this creator. And with the capital L for some reason. You know what, that's fair actually. It needs to be shorter. If I didn't hold right out of that key door, I was dead. I just had to trust it was a hold rider. Uh, I hate this. Can I go up there? No? Alright. I don't get past this guy. I guess I have to Z jump over him. Maybe? I don't think I can think of. Alright, well I checked everything here. This seems like a little kid level. I forgot it was conveyors for a moment there. Oh, you think that's funny, huh? Here, have one of these. There's something up there! I was right in believing there's a dev exit. <sighs> Not gonna worry about that hidden block. I don't even get past it. I like that. Go down here, let them kill themselves. And hit him block. That's not gonna work. Oh. A door? Do I believe the door just go right? Uh, I mean, it, it, it did kind of hide it a little bit, to be fair. Right? I have to get a Galumba. Oh no, I don't have to get a Galumba. Never mind, they're not clever. But it's gonna be instant death, right? Never mind, it really was a dev exit. Fox and the Skull asked me, why does Fox and the Skull live your story time so much? Ah, me hearty. Fox and the Skull be drawn to me tales like a compass to the north, you see. They long for the thrill of adventure, the swashbuckling escapades, and the unpredictable twists in me yarns. It's like a treasure hunt for their imagination, Savvy. Me stories be a respite from their mundane world, a chance to sail the high seas with Captain Jack Sparrow. Arr! Oh, uh, anyways, uh, I assume that was Fox. Thank you for the bits, Fox. Do I lose if I throw this? Is that instant death? I see. 
What if I do this? Okay. What is a fake reclaim? What? What? Come on, give it to me. Is that it? Didn't count? That has to be it, right? Oh, okay. Oh my god, I actually should have died there. And yes, I did cheese the level. Hey, sugar. Uh, Fox, thank you for the uh, bits as well. Uh, don't use it too much, Fox, because some people didn't like it when it was just constant, constant, constant in a row, you know? I have uh, Tango. Oh, what? Tangia? Yeah. Grasp your new power! Only the TTS and questions are allowed, Trigger. I don't do any, like, uh, memes on screen. Oh, it's a Trump. Why am I even bothering? Fox, thank you for the tier 1 gift sub to and Mario. Appreciate that. Now, you, now and Mario doesn't have to spend many rupees to get a tier 1 sub. You know, I do the second one? Oh, let me see. Who did it then? Because it's like a Fox thing. Wait. What? Oh, apparently he did it twice in a row. That's going to kill me. It's going to push the springs over and I die. Means it'd be too fun? No, it'd be bad for editing content. That's the problem. It bugged. I see, I see. The scariest music of all time. Bonus music. Also, I got a weird jump thing. I must have, like, pressed jump way too late and I got, like, a, a re-grab uh, re or something. Is this is Mario Maker 1 level? This is like a Mario Maker 1 level. Thanks. You put that spike specifically for that reason and that reason alone. They were blown away how different we are? Wait, what do you mean, Sugar? What do you mean by that? Honestly, this level deserves a boot alone for the sound effects when it's not needed when I'm doing precision, but you know. Uh, hello? Game? Oh, Jesus. I don't even know how I did that. Freaking controller grabs the vine. I almost died for that. Can't see because thwomp spam. Thanks. anymore at this point. It's just a Jay Bizzle precision level at this point. There's no way I ran out of time. I refuse to believe. God, it's so annoying. Not even good for Endless, by the way. That was a bad level for Endless. It said I'm chill? Oh. I mean, sometimes... Sometimes I get really loud, like... If you've heard me before. Do I go back to my Maker 1? Yeah, usually on Mondays. Wait. Oh. 
I should pay attention to the indicators and not think the whole level's reclaim, like it says in the title, you know. I gotta hold right really hard there. That's only five seconds. Uh, maybe it gets easier. That's a dumb reclaim. Um, wow, and that's the whole level. Yeah, I see the extra reclaim. That's the whole level right there. Can I do it? I don't know. We'll see. I keep forgetting that's a reclaim. I wish, wish it wasn't. That's a rude ending, but that's okay. I'll leave it as a neutral. So if you notice that reclaim I did with the on-off switch, the reclaim was hit so hard that it killed the shell. There's actually a small chance if you do it at the wrong time that both of the shells will collide with each other and you get no shell to land on, so yeah. Which viewer was it that you're um, okay with telling me, Sugar? I'm actually kind of curious. Thirteen minutes, huh? Low gravity probably in the sub world, I'd imagine. Do I need that? Why is he even there? Why is any of us even here, honestly? I know why it's 13 minutes long if the whole level's like this. I wanna make sure there's nothing over here. Just gotta make sure. Because we already have a dev exit level to fame. Can't remember? Alright, fair enough. If you don't remember, it's fine. Uh, Hotel, I have played Mario w uh, Wonder and I beat the whole game 100% already. You can catch it! Jesus. You can catch it on the VODs. I uploaded them already. That was just perfect timing to die there. Oh yeah, we had that command, I forgot about that. Why am I even playing this? What if the red coins are actually required? There's a shell in that block, does that matter? Yeah, I would like that, please. This level is a very confusing level. There's a checkpoint down there, by the way. I kind of want to get the checkpoint over anything else. To be honest. a feeling that uh, the red coins are not required based on what I see here. 
Bouncy land? Yes, bouncy land. One up? Yes, one up. Fine. Do we have to kill them? That is an excellent question. Probably not, to be honest. Well, we're here, I guess we can fight these guys. Because we want to kind of explore a little bit, don't we? Maybe? Oh, well. That makes things a little easier, huh? There, now they're all dead. All the ones that mattered in you. Why am I even getting the right coins? Do I need them? Still unknown. That's a waste of time is what this is so far. I feel like a little kid made this, so probably not required. We'll see. I'm just gonna damage boost. They give out way too many power-ups. They cannot be required. How I see it anyways. And I think I'm... You know what? There's two checkpoints. There's no way the creator did this unless they had a hidden key if it's required. There's no way. I refuse to believe. <sighs> but I gotta go for it anyways, right? Because it's just there. And if it's convenient, might as well grab them. Bowser? Imagine it was a triple stack. I know it can't be because of- Oh, I'm getting hit. Up. Oh, sure. I guess I'll kill Bowser while I'm here. Yeah, figures. Am I gonna get stuck? Uh, maybe I should take damage. Do I even want to use this yet? I'm gonna keep it, just to be safe. There's nothing over there I can see that would be actually worthwhile in my time. I grabbed that. I thought I stepped on it. What? Oh, yeah, it's if I can see that. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Alright, are we done? Yes. Thank god. Get me out of here. Also, what was the red coins for? I didn't see a single key door that mattered. Is a punishment for poorly made levels? Would it surprise you if I told you this level is actually a meh? Because there's like no trolls and the spam is okay because of the power-ups spread across the level equally. The only hard part about this level is the beginning before the first checkpoint because of the blue skull platforms. Unless I see a dev exit or an actual hostile action such as a death door or death pipe, I'm not gonna boot. It's got two checkpoints. How can I be mad at that? Yes, it looked like, you know, a mess as one could say. Probably made by a, you know, a seven-year-old, maybe. But it didn't do anything that really said, hey, boo this. Oh. Oh, God. 
You just had to do it, huh? It just, I mean, you get, you get resets and I hate this so much because it's actually worth doing. Dude, I actually almost made it first try. Didn't even make it at all. I went too far. Good level? It's actually not getting the boo. Off screen trump generally means, yeah, boo, but you get rabbit resets, so. Who am I to judge? You know? They did what I would make. If I were to make a trump like this, this is how I would do it for a shell jump trump. Although I wouldn't put it off screen because I'm not a, you know. I'm not an asshole when it comes to level design in terms of that way. Although I guess it would be funny to watch a streamer do it, but this lacks the fun aspects of a, a level. If you're gonna watch a streamer do this. We could send this to Sugar. It would be pretty funny, wouldn't it? I mean, he's him himself said good level. What do you mean that's not a trump? I went right through there. Dang it. Uh, I must have missed it by like one pixel because I slid right into the spike wall. You know. Oh, what am I doing? I don't want to. Wait, <laughs> I need the mushroom. What are you doing? Honestly, if this had no off-screen business, I would like this because of the way it's designed. The off-screen business is why I'm, it's not getting a like, even with the three one-ups. They did it on purpose just to make people suffer. You can lower the, the thing by a couple blocks. Not that hard, you know. Maybe one block. You can lower it by one block, lower everything by one block so I can see my character, maybe. Maybe even lower than that, I don't know. Actually, you know what? Just put something in the top left of the screen so I can see what I'm doing. That's how you, you're able to see more than one block height uh, of a level. This level is built for only half the height vertically in a horizontal plane. If you just put an item in the top left, you can see above. Oh my, if, I get so close every time. I mean, I'm getting pretty close, right? Just some 2020 levels, Ryzen. It doesn't have to be 2000 un or 2019 unclear. Dude, it's so close. It's mostly luck because I can't see my character. This is correct. Yeah, I'll just skip it and leave it as a meh at, when I get to that point. Whoa! Look at this. Look at these spikes. They have like that weird tint, like a really poorly photoshopped, transparent look on those spikes. The, the one on the top and the bottom, you know, facing each other towards the flagpole. What is that? Now I can't unsee it. It's only when I don't have the clear condition item. What do you mean that's not a Trump jump? I didn't even hear myself hit the spike. I must have been super close. Too early, I should have twirled. Again, too early. You know, technically you actually can just wait for the shell to come back alive. You don't need to do the shell jump. I didn't even hear myself hit the spike. It's so close every single time. I'm not even like moving in a direction. I'm just going for it. Let's see if I get it. What am I doing? That was a weird twirl.
How's the algo? It's all right. My lives are pretty fine. Too early. What am I doing? I need to get the mushroom. Hey, I got it! Wow. I didn't think I'd get it. It's run your lunch? Well, I hope the clearer fixed it. Hello, Benny. Welcome to the world of Mario Maker. <laughs> I gotta say, I love my roguelikes, and this is kind of like why I like Endless so much, I think. You'll send it to Pang at a steal world record? Yeah, make sure he does like a Z drop as well, so it's faster. Any level suggestion for zero point? Yes, I do actually. Hold on. Not like it's gonna matter though, because he doesn't take level requests anymore. We live in a world. Did I miss the red coin already? I might have. He finished the wheel finally? God dang, finally. Yeah, let me skip this or beat this, and then we'll go from there. I'm gonna fly over. Gave me the ultimate power. Except it only does this, huh? Oh, no! You, you even blocked it off! This is the worst title screen of, like, any level, man. I can at least check to see if I missed anything now. No? Alright, fine. Play it the legit way. There's no way to rig the algorithm to give me only cool levels. Badly. I wonder what those blocks are. How come Bowser isn't firing all the time? That's weird. Oh god. Why? <laughs> oh my god, dude, the lava rising scares the crap out of me in this level. Oh, that goes. That's kind of a waste. Getting that 10 coins a waste as well. That 30 coin could be worth it. I wonder if, no, I probably don't need the red coins, right? There was a way to make one-ups in the previous zone. The problem with that is the lava's going up. So I can't really technically make one-ups there, even if I wanted to. Is there a red coin down there? Look, one up. I can go over as well, but I'll play the level. They already cheesed me earlier. 
even if I'd rather not play. It's fine, do that. You are the worst, and that's why you put that there. How dare. Is this even worth it? How long is this? Unclear. At point level. Eh. I know how these go. That was a really good one shot, and now it's going to go downhill. I I would have bow, like bad Bowser RG coming up next time. It's not worth it. It's just not. Huh. That's fine. It gives us the reason to go. Oh my god. Here goes the mushroom. Checkpoint. If I want the checkpoint, I don't know. Isn't there like a, is there a hidden one up over here? I'm gonna eat it, aren't I, for doing this? No? Did they forget the one up in 1 1? That one dash one, I agree. Even the checkpoint, a couple of the spike balls that ran across instead of going straight down was kind of unfortunate. But this could be an interesting multiplayer versus level. I guess I'd be okay with it. I was thinking about it, I'm like, do I really want this to be multiplayer versus? But then after thinking about it, yeah, actually, wouldn't that be that bad? Waiting at the flagpole would be really hard though. They let you skip a boss fight. Well, good to know, I guess. I might have to do this again, hold on. You can just time the jump. Uh, fine, we'll try the jump, it might be easier. I timed it wrong. That's the hardest part of the whole level, is either doing that or doing the wall jump. I don't know what's easier, to be honest. I'm a little afraid of both. That's why it's a super expert. It's a final jump. It has nothing to do with anything else.
Oh, hold on. I got this. I gotta be careful not die, though. Bullets don't have bags either. Confirmed. Alright, now that we got that. How do I want to do this? Maybe the bullets actually are useful for something? Did I miss out on something? Maybe the bullets actually were supposed to kill me. Like, what is this again? The wall jump. The wall jump doesn't look like it's gonna make it though, that's the problem. I think we do it like this. Look at that. I couldn't wall jump. What are you kidding? Oh, man. I had it too. I had the timing. I had everything else down. I had the extra wall in case I messed up so I could wall jump back up. But no, I had to just die again. There might be an easier way of doing this, to be honest. But this is the easiest way that I see it, so... Oh, that's fine. I won't need them anyways. There we go. Jeez. If you hit that exclamation point block, by the way, I think you die as well. On the way up. Hey, you don't need to ping me. It's not gonna help you anyways. You can just remove the at sign and put my username. It does the same effect anyways. Now go finish your lunch and get back to whatever you're doing. The hardest part about this whole level is that I have this red coin somewhere. Huh. I need on-offs apparently. I can't distract him if I'm not looking at chat, sugar. Yeah, I mean, I kind of had no choice at that point. Because Mushroom doesn't even help me there. Random boom boom fight. <laughs> There's this alien five red coin, so it could just be in the subworld. Alright. Very interesting. So far not really bad of level. There's a couple blind things here and there unless you like have to explore a bit. It's just one layer acceptable within memes.
You know, I probably need the red coin, so even if I wanted to, I can't just use the spring to cheese this area. I have to keep looking around. Yoshi has to go to the right. See, look, there's a red coin right here. I mean, now I can cheese it easily with the spring on that question mark block, but, you know. Too late now. Nope. Don't know why there's two of you. I'm holding on to the other one. Actually, I think for safety reasons, I should leave this Yoshi right here. So if I lose Yoshi, I can always come back and get him. Assuming I don't, like, you know, die on the way back. It is really weird that Yoshi has three bullets from a piranha in this game, but only one in Mario Maker 1. I don't know why they changed it. I mean, I'm glad they changed it to a triple shot, but it is pretty weird. All right, fine. We'll check your content door. A bonus song? All right. Fair enough. No sugar falconini in the chat. I forgot that was a rule. All right, more content doors. Let's do it. Let's do it. What? Why would I go down there? All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to grab an extra piece, which in case they decide to screw us over. That's the plan now. Uh... Let's go through the pipe. It might be better. There we go. Now that we get screwed over, we have a P-switch to get back with. More coins. So what is the point of your red coins if you have an easy P-switch bonus room that gives you three one-up? Oh. Because you locked me out. Well, there goes your like. That was the whole thing. You're trying to get me to die. I mean, it's not like he won't have three one-ups at that point, but he's just gonna kill the player for being curious. At least try to be funny about it. Also, a barb level. You know, I know how barb makes his levels. I know this will kill my run. Probably. More than likely. If I were to commit to it. Nobody says drop it like it's cold. Nobody. And I mean nobody. Too much speed. Let's keep this up. There we go, cheese. Mario. Sure. This is like ass of a section. No, 
Oh, there's another one up there. Oh, you're such a rude icicle level creator. Can't even see that one. Uh, miss some TV. Thank you for the prime in three months. Welcome back, Mario. No, we're playing Luigi. Sorry. Fifteen seconds. That first one is definitely a uh, hidden block, for sure. That's an indicator for hidden block. But I don't trust this level. I know we only see like barely anything of it, but I have a feeling it's gonna throw in like a slip shell jump or something crazy. Luigi Mario. Yeah, that's accurate because uh, Luigi's last name is Mario. That's fair. <laughs> There's no way you need that, right? Wow, thanks. Wait time in my speed run? I'd never. I mean, I can get one ups here. I have to hit this no matter what. Wait, no, I don't. Lied to me. That's not a Z jump. That's a small jump twirl section. How dare you? Can I just do this? Yeah, nice uh, wait time section. Come on, give it to me. Give me the bomb. You can actually activate the bomb early for the speedrun, too. They also had no intention to give me anything other than the coins of level. That's fine, though. Yep, it's actually Mario Mario and Luigi Mario. I don't know why. If you're wondering why I didn't like it, it's because the piece of wait time is kind of meh, but also, you know, other reasons I have just shown through my gameplay. I have to hold right there, I think. Yeah. Hey, Ollie. I know the setup, but I'm trying to figure out how they want me to do it. I just have to trust it, I think, by holding jump. Yeah, I have to do that. The problem was the spikes on the ceiling. I didn't feel comfortable holding jump there, so. Hmm. It's not a bad level, though. Just got a little bit of artificial difficulty, but overall it's a pretty okay level. Got three one-ups. I guess it's acceptable, yeah. Oh yeah, speaking of which, I was going to show you a level that if we should give the zero, I completely forgot to be honest. It should still be in the list down here. I don't think we've passed it yet. It was a really bad, terrible level. You can easily turn off, like, comets for it to be good.
I think I still have the world record in it, unless, you know, sugar took it. Let me see. This one. If uh, Corbin is still here, this is the level that you want to send to zero. Tell him to turn the comments off. Because it's, this level has a horrible deb accent. You one, two, three, four from. The creator put beat it as a stamp in their own level. Truly a masterpiece of its time. But if you want to send this to anyone, this one has a sad deb accent. It's really hard. But this is the one for Corbin here. There you go. Alright, back to your regularly scheduled super expert. And the on no. When I meant any streamer, I meant ones that appreciate garbage and has at least like let's put it this way. Having patience would be really good for that kind of level, because it's it's bad. Once you know where the dev Well, I guess you could set it to on. Just let her know, hey, if you get tired of the level, turn on comments. Or if she doesn't have comments on, just tell her like halfway through. Be like, hey, turn on comments, that's really important. I guess if you really want to send it to her. But only make sure you do it that way, otherwise I won't recommend it. Because if you don't take the dev exit route, I mean, I, even I took the dev exit route, because once I got to like the second to last boss fight with no power up, I'm like, yeah, this is not a real level at all. No way, I, I refuse to believe it's real. If it was my Maker 1, I would believe it, but it's not my Maker 1, so you know. Mm, if I had a shell here, make one-ups easily in this level. Just anyone who enjoys Garbo would enjoy that level, I feel like. Because it's kind of funny, but also sad. Hammers from the sky, oh no. Fine, we have a fire flower over here. I think we also have one over the left as well, but Yeah. It, it is it, it's honestly a juicy level to send to zero. You you will love it. Like, if you saw my playthrough, I got very frustrated because I had no power-up for the longest time. And all of a sudden, the stupid Morton fight that doesn't even seem believable. As long as his comments are off, don't say a word. Just check to see if his comments are off first. It's fine. It's not fine. Definitely not fine. Because if his comments are off, you don't have to say a word. And then once he doesn't believe it himself, he'll turn comments on himself, you know? All you have to do is start playing games when you're one and a half years old, and that's like most of the, your playtime is on. It'll get as good as this. A lot of years invested into video gaming, which is probably not healthy to be fair, but it got me somewhere into where I want to be today, so that's cool, but also kind of expected that. Is this one of those long eight minute levels? Yeah, it is. I was practicing my shell jumps. <laughs> I 
I'm doing fine. That is funny, though. He'll probably just jump over me, right? Yeah. Ooh, I have an idea for don't jump level underwater now. With fire flowers. It's actually not a bad idea. Then again, the idea of underwater don't jump level is already bad, so never mind. I take back what I said. Probably should just kill these guys first. Get them out of the way so they don't bother me in the run. Take a damage, I have to. Someone actually made a Titanic level in Super Expert, and it was terrible. I think you had to kill the sun or something for a key that honestly had zero hints about in an earlier area, or accessible area, you know? That still hit me well. It was, it was just terrible vertical level design. Cool idea, but like, definitely not a great level. Also, who asked for a maze in this level? Feels like a Mithra level now, who makes the super expert garbage levels. I'm gonna time out! One of those levels, I'm just gonna have to time out, I guess. I was expecting a, a soft lock there. Or anti soft lock mecha. Yay, you made it out of my maze. Here, now enjoy your fire flower. You need it. Also, I don't recommend sending this one to Zero because it's just boring. Not a juicy one. I, I always send him like dev exit ones because they're just the most fun. Nah, I'm good. Although, I could have made one of off of those Magic Koopas, but too late now. Mm, it has checkpoints, but the Dark Mace is just so boring, it's like... Yeah, if you just reboot the Dark Maze, I feel like it'd be more fun. If it was a maze without darkness, I wouldn't boo it. The fact that it was dark makes it even harder to get around. Dark Water Maze with Spam is my favorite genre, yeah. If you aren't playing Hidden Block Scavenger Hunts, you're not living life. That's how I feel sometimes. Skill levels are fine. They're whatever. I do enjoy a good platformer. Uh, speaking of uh, my first speed run, yeah. There's a random Z. Oh, okay. I was not expecting you. Hello, sir. If there's a random Z in the level, it gets a boo, but I think I'll leave it as a neutral. As long as it's not blind. Hey, that's a whole level. I don't know how I missed on off though. How long do you think today's stream is? It depends on what people are doing later today. Otherwise, we'll just end at Mario. I need to hold right there because that cannonball is unreliable. To wait. There, there's probably a chance where I don't have to wait, but I'm gonna wait anyways. Let's wait. There we go. Trick or treating as grown ass adults? No, I'm talking about the game from yesterday and Phasma later today.
All right, confirmation from IJS Infinite Jump Slash. He says he'll be here in seven hours or so. I don't know why I'm playing this. This is not a good level for Endless, probably. Wee, what is that? What kind of jump is that? Blind. I really hope I don't need that on-off change. i to find out the hard way. Nope. Unless it matters here, then I have to dive for it, you know. Doesn't matter. Next life it will matter, though. No one-ups, as per usual. Weird. What do you mean? The level itself, yeah. Or weird that there's no one-ups. I mean, that's not weird. You know that by now at this point. Pro level, by the way. Wow. How do I get that? The other way around, right? It's just like a mushroom on the other side. I figured that's what it was. Too late now, though. The level setup was strange. It was like a weird on-off section, to be fair, in the castle level. Yeah, Mario Trail kind of makes sense, you know, the way it was designed. Oh, I just thought I was racing something and then I realized, oh yeah. Well, might as well just get these, I guess, while I'm here. How the hell do you expect me to dodge all that? Big jump? Yeah, but don't hit the ceiling. Let me get these coins first. Wait, what is stopping me from- wait, hold on. <laughs> Get cheese. Forgets the level concept immediately. That's fine. Maybe we'll get lucky and get. Oh, maybe we'll get lucky. He says. The landmine over here, dude. Three one ups. I missed three one-ups earlier? How dare you? And you- You don't even give me top, how dare? I deserve those three one-ups, what do you mean? Nah, I cheese the whole level to be fair. Whatever, moving on. I wonder if they did the same thing. That level looked really hard, otherwise. Uh, there's another power up there. I don't know what that's about. Am I gonna die instantly? I mean, it was on screen, but there was a distraction to my left, and there's no way I was gonna be able to look at that door in time. Why is there... 
Yeah, you can't even- wait. That's a troll, then. Because... You actually can't even do anything with that pal up there. Z-jump. I gotta go faster. We got our three one-ups, just gotta go faster and trust the level. I had it. Let's see, 28 seconds. The level actually might be tight-ish with three seconds of leniency. Last try, maybe. What? Easily cheese this. This ending, though. It wasn't that tight. I think you could beat the level with like eight seconds of leniency. Huh. Surprisingly, only 19 skips today for this set. <laughs> 